Whoa. I think I'm live. Oh, brilliant. Fantastic. I'm, and I'm sort of like early as well. And wow, I'm going to let a few people know that I'm here um, as well, which is great. Thank you. Thank you for joining me. And if you're on the replay, welcome. Welcome. Enjoy. I'm sure we're going to have a, a wonderful time. Uh, excuse me while I just um, a, a little bit silent. I'm just just going to let a few people know that um, we're here and we're live. How exciting! I love this. I love doing this. It was um, Laura from Jersey Crafter and Beth who said, "Come on, <laughs> go live." Oh, love it. So I'm going to do some sharing. Oh, just to say to people, I'm here. Don't want to be a pest. I know it's, see, it's two o'clock in the afternoon here, but of course for you guys, it's, um, there you go. I'm just letting a few people know. Oh, and Ben, I must let Ben know actually. He might, he's working, but he might be able to. Did that send? <laughs> Let's see. Did it send? Oh, I don't know whether it did actually. Hold on a minute. I'm live, but it's only not even two yet. People are expecting me to come live at two. So I'm just going to try sharing that again. Um, and I expect people in America are just, just about getting up. <laughs> there you go. And one, just let Ben know. There you go. Um... Hold on a minute. Sorry about this. Oh, look at me just letting people know. And there's people here. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh, silly me. Hi, Kendra and Candy. Oh, lovely. We meet again. I keep, it's so, it's fantastic, isn't it? I keep bumping into you guys. I was going to put some hand cream on actually before I started. <laughs> um, keep bumping into you guys in all the other streams and it, it's oh I love it I love it <laughs> just put some hand cream on now a little bit more professional setup today not professional but you know <laughs> a little bit better I hopefully I'm not going to drop you this time Ben came around last night and we gaffer taped the camera to the stand and We've gone back to the kitchen steps scenario, so I can move you a little bit further that way, maybe. And so my hands show, and oh, lovely. Good morning, because I know it's early for you guys over there. <laughs> so here we are. Here is, um, oh, what did we, did we call him? I can't remember now. Um, Tuki, here is Tuki. <laughs> oh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's see, I've got a few more red bits that I can be putting, putting on Tuki. Well, red polka dot. Did people see Beth's polka dot bikini? That was such fun, wasn't it, that she made? Oh, such fun. The chicken on a beach on when was that Saturday evening in the polka dot bikini? Such fun! Let me turn it this way around. It's sorry, it just takes me a while to work out because it's different every time. There you go, that's the bottom of them. There you go, you can see him now. <laughs> how are you, Kendra? How are you? How's your night been? I don't know. 
how you sleep. I'm, I'm sure it can't be easy. And you have busy days with your therapy, I know. <laughs> lovely to see you here. And lovely to people who are gently listening in the background. Welcome to you too. And Caroline, sending you loads of love. Brave old Caroline. You'll be not so much of the old. How rude. Didn't mean it like that. <laughs> Brave Caroline. Watching on the replay. You're so welcome. <laughs> Great to have you here. I'll just put a few bits onto Tuki. Now, when do I call Tuki finished? There are more gaps where the red is. The um, he's very full up, bless him. Let's see if I can get him more in frame. Look at that. I'm even managing to move the camera without it um, tipping over. My days are good, but the nights are a nightmare. Yeah, it seems like worse during the night. Oh, do you know? Physical pain and emotional pain are always worse um, at night, aren't they? And it feels like if you move, you wake people up. And, yeah. I um, woke up in the night and I like to have streamers on. I, I caught up with um, Mary and what she was doing. Candy said... He's done when I'm satisfied. <laughs> oh, that's kind of you, Ken, Candy, to say that to Kendra. Yeah. Um, yeah, he's done when I'm satisfied. I'm finding myself working on him less. He's becoming less of a, yeah. When he's done, I will show you a picture of him or do a little vlog um, in situ on the fireplace <laughs> yeah yeah he doesn't have to be completely full does he no you're right he's done oh yes bless your husband yes he is he is an angel bless him yes Gosh, you're working hard though on your therapy, aren't you, Kendra? Making small steps, small steps. Frustrating though, because you sometimes want to, you want to make big steps, yeah. This is fiddly, but satisfying. Fiddly but satisfying. So who thinks I should phone Beth? She said she didn't mind last time. <laughs> and welcome to Meljoy, who may be listening in the background. Our dear Meljoy can't be here today. She's got to work. Um, so we're missing her. But we totally understand no stress only come when you can Melanie <laughs> here you go I'm loving putting these polka dotty bits on when you want me to change and start something else just say because I've got lots of things planned today I did say you know, I've put on the title, bookmarks, bookmarks, I mean tags for the swap. And yeah, well, the cameras at quite a good angle, I feel, today. <laughs> and hopefully it won't drop off. Should have seen Ben and I yesterday taping it up. <laughs> Gaffer taping it, two chopping, it's a it's got two chopping boards and a step ladder. <laughs> and it's done. I'm actually just gonna let them know that I'm on online because um 
he may he may join us. Oh, so nice to see everybody. <laughs> maybe maybe we will phone. We will phone Beth. What do you think? <laughs> There we are. A few more polka dotty bits. Yeah, he's done when he's done, isn't he? Um, let me show you Freddie. Now the whole thing about this is that it moves over like this. And I can show you Freddie. Let's see if I can show you Freddie. There he is. Can't quite see his head, but his head's under there. Oh, bless him. He's, he's resting. <laughs> he says hi. And then it swings around. Look at that. Can't say fairer than that, can you? I'm loving that. It actually works, Ben. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Abigail. Abigail, how nice. Look at that. How nice to see you here. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. Um, I'm just doing, putting some more things on Tuki while we wait for other people to come in or while I wait for people to say, no, do something different now, Janet. Stop putting things on Tuki. <laughs> You've got plenty of other bits and pieces to get on with too. See if we can find some new things for Kendall to put on her list. <laughs> oh, Abigail, you're you're over in the states too, are you? Because it's morning with you. It's the afternoon here in England. Two two o'clock in the afternoon. I'm loving this polka dotty paper. Stick some more. Now, are you going to stay in frame when I turn him over? This is wing and his tail feathers. <laughs> yep, you're in shot. You can see there's a few bits of gaps. Now, Penny is, um, I've just got a few more bits, for, red bits for me. Um, and then I'll probably say when I put those on, it's done. Um, that's it. Sorry, my hands aren't in frame. Just shout to me if um, my hands get out of frame. <laughs> Actually, it's scrapbooking paper and it's a different pattern on the other side. So, yeah, Penny's got a few bits and she lives around the corner. So Freddie and I can go and collect some bits from um, Penny. Penny might, might pop in later. She has to go, or doesn't have to. She loves to go and see her mum in the mornings. And will join us later. I cut up a, a Coke can. And I keep, I slotted these on, but they keep falling off. I need to find some way to make those stay on i might need to put some wire on them or something yeah <laughs> that's it there we are i'll just put a few more bits on and then we'll swap to something else <laughs> there he is so we did um my lovely tukey he's made from chicken wire and Oh, Ben, there you go. There's Ben. The setup, Ben, is fantastic. I love it. It's not falling off. And no one, oh, well, actually, I did tell people. I was going to say, no one, well, no one can see the two chopping boards, one oniony one. <laughs> mm. Melanie's working today, Ben, so can't, can't be. Can't be around today with us. Test the view. Oh, good. Test the Freddy view. Well, we have tested the Freddy view, but I'm sure you'd love to see Freddy. 
let me see. He moves. A, a look, look, a smooth operation. He's just around the wrong way. So I'm going to stand up then and hold it in and then just lift it up. There you go. We have the free cam. Isn't that fantastic? What are, what are you saying, Ben, that I should be working here so people can see Freddie at the same time? Is that what you're saying? Yeah? I think that's what you meant. Um, Freddie, say hi to Kendra. She's saying hi. <laughs> we went for a walk, didn't we, Kendra, the other day? I have some walks planned for you guys with Freddie. It's a little bit um, overexposed, isn't it, what I'm working on? But I think the most important thing is seeing Freddie, isn't it? That <laughs> looks great. I know. <laughs> It's great, isn't he? He can stay there, can't he? He's probably thinking, where's Melanie? Oh, no pressure, Melanie. Sorry, darling. <laughs> I'm just, um, I'm going to be a pest and I'm going to phone up. I'm going to phone Beth. She doesn't mind. She doesn't mind. Should we give her a little ring? You can't see him fully here. But yeah, I think I'm going to keep the camera on. I'm Freddie, well, why not? <laughs> Is anybody good at posting things in a group if I were to make you a moderator? I don't want to put pressure on anybody. That's the last thing I want to do. I want this to be a relaxing. There we are. I'm going to phone Beth. What a pain I am. <laughs> there we are. I haven't put her on FaceTime. <laughs> Just phoning. Looks good. It's great to see Freddie, isn't it? Yeah. Freddie comes first. Craft comes second, I think. I'm just being a pest. Phoning Beth. Oh, I get the ringtone. I'm not going to phone her for too long. I'm going to put the phone down now. <laughs> right, where's that metal? I was going to put some of that on. Hmm. Well, I'll see. I'm going to stop doing him now, actually, because I think you guys would like to see something different. I'm going to put. I'm going to, last time I popped him in the bin, didn't I? Because he, he could stand up in the bin. He's getting a bit more stable now, actually. I'm just going to start on something else. I'm going to show you what I've been up to this week. And you can see Freddie all at the same time. Here we are. Here is my... I'm wondering if I pop it down a little bit, whether it'll be less exposed to the light. Is that better? Here you go. I know you guys want to see Freddie. Yes. <laughs> I keep saying your name. Here we are. Here's my journal. This is what I've used instead of chicken wire, just in case you haven't got chicken wire. Oh, what's the... Oh, Abigail. There we are. I am so sorry. What was the project I was working on? He is a chicken wire. It's hard for you to tell at this angle, isn't it? He's a, let me get it up again for you. He's a chicken wire. Thanks for asking. I'm so glad you asked. He's a chicken wire. Look at him there. <laughs> He's a toucan. I made a big collage of a toucan. And then I decided to make a, a wire, chicken wire former. And I have just been threading bits and bobs and pieces on him. Locks, buttons, toys, threads, bringing him to life, making him colourful. Oh, thank you, Abigail. But you know, if you look online, because Beth Shula, she did, um, oh, thanks. She did um, a toucan, a painting of the toucan. That got me interested, and I looked at them and I thought, Wow, they are so colourful. Their beaks 
and the bibs, the rest of them are black, but I just wanted to make him very colourful. There we are. So it's just about putting the red, red bits on now. All the beads and paper beads and things. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. And then we decided, we, we thought, oh, you're right. Oh, he's off. He's going. So I'll move it around a bit. And when he comes back, we'll put it on him again. And I've got some little treats so I can call him back any time if you want to see him. <laughs> you listening in the background while you work then? Oh, that's Beth saying, yep. Yeah. I'll just say, oh, um, I'll, I'll just say, there you go. I'll just, just message Beth back. And yes, you are, you're working at the same time. That's brilliant. So every anytime you want to see, your lovely Freddy, I should just get him back with the tree. He's probably just nipped upstairs to look out the window. So then, Abigail, we we just we thought not everybody's got chicken wire, so we um, threaded some ribbons. I made a journal out of a box, so people could have a little project. And they could tie bits. Makes it great. We call this Ben Boho. <laughs> Hello, lovely Malaya. How nice to see you. Oh. <laughs> Hello, beautiful Malaya. Oh, we were in a group the other day. Was it Laura's? And we were saying how lovely your name is, Malaya. We were talking about names. <laughs> I love the way we meet each other in all the different streams. So, yes, so Abigail, if you don't worry, if you don't have chicken wire and still want to make something, you can do one of these. So, I've been, I put three signatures in, and this is the paper we made last week. Oh, just to say, um, who was with us last week? Uh, oh, it'll come to me. What's her name? Fran. Fran on the Edge, she's actually streaming at the moment too, as well. So if you want to go over to Fran on the Edge, do show her some love and support um, and catch up with this later on or catch up with her later, do, because she was doing this last week as well. So pop over if you, if you want to, even if it's just for a little while, to um, Fran on the edge. And I put some papers in. And we made this last week, this little corner pocket to go in the journal. And we made, this was our, some of our eco prints. And these were some violets that we found. Stretching over. I'm just getting used to this camera angle, so there we are. Thank you. Thank you, Abigail. Yes, it was just, I was just trying to come up with something that if people wanted the relaxation of tying bits and pieces on, they didn't have to have chicken wire. They could make the journal and it, it, it's it's lovely to feel I'm going to put more stuff on and it'll be great as we make things and paper clips and things we can just hang things on we make some paper beads we can just put them on we can um we can do anything you like <laughs> so I had some I was in a swap and crafting mamas with Alyssa and she sent me these beautiful napkins with um violets on so I thought I might add these to the card I'm not quite sure how it's going to look you know like when you add things 
And then you think, oh, I wish I hadn't done that. But I'm going to give it a go. Here's my lovely Mod Podge. Let's see, what have we got? Um, yeah, I'll just, I'll just add some of these and we'll see how we go. So this is just the sort of thing I'm going to be doing today. But if you want me to get onto the paper clips or the bookmarks, just say, oh, Beth. Oh, it's Monday. Oh, Beth. I'm, I'm so naughty, aren't I, to wake you up on a Monday morning. But um, I was just missing you, Beth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Let me know if I, Shelley. Hi, Shelley. So nice, so nice that you could come, you can come over. Hi there. Good morning. I'm saying good morning to you, Penny. Hey, Penny. I was just saying that um, I'm nearly finished Tuki, the toucan, but I'm going to pop round to Penny's because you've got a few more bits and then that that's probably that could probably be done i've got a little um i've got a little atc card that i made for penny so i wanted to pop round anyway it's only about 15 minutes walk away ben's got the car this week so um A walk around would be fantastic. I thought there was something lacking on this. These are these violets are pressed flowers. We put those on last week. So I'm just adding a napkin. Lovely to see you, Beth. <laughs> Lovely that you can join us, Shelley. Really nice. I'm just um if you want me to show you the cover of the journal or just shout out if you want me to do anything different i'm happy to how are you penny because of course it's the afternoon for us if you had a busy morning and your this is your time to rest after being with your mum i went over my the date i put the date on let's take that off there you go, like that. <laughs> there we are. This might cheer this little greetings card up, actually. Maybe it just did need something else. Lovely. Little violets on here. Someone was saying violets were their favourite flower. Was that Laura saying that violets were her mum's favourite flower? I can't remember now. That's why it's good to write things down when people say it's their favourite colour or their, something's their favourite. Here we are. So, yeah, we're going to do some gluing and sticking. And I thought, oh, I saw this napkin and I thought, right, let's just use that. <laughs> Oh, it does look quite nice, doesn't it? There we are. I compliment myself. Did you stitch the pages in? Oh, from the book, um, Penny. I, I, I did actually. Um, what do you call that stitch? Good morning, Janet. How are you? Ah, oh, I, I think he. I don't know. What's this called, Janet? I'm going to, it's Janet USA. <laughs> and speaking to Janet UK. <laughs> How lovely. Really nice to see you. Yes, Penny, you were saying I, I stitched. Let me put something. Oh, no, the glue's there. I did stitch it in. What's that stitch that you use? Is it oh, pamphlet stitch? Oh, Janet's going to thank you. She's going to post in the groups. Teresa, good morning. 
How are you? How lovely to see you all. How lovely. All the American girls popping in. It's it's early for you guys, I know. Um, yes, pamphlet stitch. Yes, and I did three signatures. But if you didn't want to do that, you could use elastic and just put elastic round and slip your signatures in. Penny, thank you. It's the... Um, Chicken wire alternative. And Cheryl, lovely Cheryl's probably sleeping at the moment. Oh, it's 9.30. Okay. Okay. Um, lovely Cheryl named this after being on the string. She named this journal, Girls Just Want to Have Fun. <laughs> that was sweet because we were having fun. Oh, Cheryl, Cheryl will find us um, soon, I'm, I'm sure. Girls just want to have fun. And Cheryl didn't want to make a big journal, so she made a little one. So I just had to make a little one too. <laughs> there we are. So let me know what you'd like me to show you. You do the Coptic stitch. Yes, you do. You do. I've done the Coptic stitch when I've had birthday cards and I put them together to make them into... Um, a tag book yeah you let me know what you'd like me to shirt to do would you like me to continue working in here or would you like me to show you the little mini journal i'm happy so i'm just going to let this card dry i'm not sure whether it looks a bit busy now i don't know i might need to do something else to it i'm not sure we'll let it dry and then we'll say <laughs> These were Mel Joy's flowers last week. This camera setup's much better, Ben, because um, I can see every everybody can see what I'm doing. Um, Ben's lurking in the chat because he's working. Oh, and this is what I did from last week's. From last week's, these are some of the blackberry. <laughs> Cheryl, good morning. Hey, you must have heard me. I was literally just said your name. Cheryl's ears were burning. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, do you need to go and get yourself a coffee, Cheryl? <laughs> Lovely. Um, do you remember me squishing the blackberries with the um, rolling pin? I got this lovely... Um, let me put it further up because it's very light. I did that on um, with all that paper that's see-through. It'll come to me in a minute. Um, hmm. Deli paper. That's it. Beth. Oh, Beth, nip and get yourself some coffee. Or oh, call Joe. You need a little bell. Beth, call Joe and say, I need coffee. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I stamped it too with my Blackberry stamp. I carved the Blackberry stamp probably this time last year. Um, I was listening. Dolly paper. Ooh. It does look a bit like a doily. Doily or dolly? Am I saying it wrong? Doily. It does look a bit like doily paper. This was deli paper. But, and one of Melanie's little spots in there. A little bird that you know. <laughs> I think that was probably Janet. Well done. Oh, thank you. You're, you are too kind. Too kind. So, yes. I, Mary got me into carving stamps. Uh, Meljoy gave me this lovely stuff. Um, and it's just nice at this time of year using it again this year. I put some on there and um, just rub it like this. Oh, 
Oh, I have to make a list. Oh, Beth's starting me off with a list. Show so it's how I carve. Oh, I will. Yes, I will, Beth, because, yes, a little bird, tweet, tweet. <laughs> um, I will show you because I learned from Mary, and obviously I'm just a beginner, but sometimes it's nice to see people doing things and, you know, they haven't got it perfect and, you know, yeah, and doing it live, yes, I, I to have courage. Um, it's like it's like um, you when you're doing your painting, Beth. You have to have a lot of courage to do that live, and I so admire you. And that, if, oh, if you want to go and see, um, go back on the replay to see. Um, doesn't stamp off perfectly because I'm a beginner. Um, Fran, hello, hi, thank you for popping in. Hey. Fran, you're live, aren't you, now? Pop over to Fran as well, people. Go between the two of us. <laughs> Please do. That would be lovely. So, yes, so what I'm saying is I agree with you. I will show you. Yes, I will show. I will do a, a stamp carving. Go to Mary. Look, look up hers, how she does it, because Mary is fab. Mary Art Artillier, is that how you say it? Cheryl, oh, there you go. It doesn't print off too badly. It's not too shabby, as they would say. Um, Cheryl, how is Freddy? Well, Ben has set me up. A Freddy cam, but I need Freddy to come down because he's he's gone off just to look at out the front. He was here a minute ago, so I'm just going to shake the snacks. I just like this or lift the lid off. Freddy, Freddy, I just have to lift the lid off a bit, and he can smell them. It's fish. <laughs> oh, oh gosh, it does smell. I'm glad it's not. Freddy, the girls want to see you, darling. Come on, here he comes, here he comes. So all I do is look at this. Over to the Freddy cam. <laughs> oh, come on, darling, come and sit down here. Come on to the Freddy cam, dear. Oh, that's it. Now people want to people want to see your face. They really don't want to see my craft. People want to see Freddy. Isn't that right? There he is. Now, it just needs to go up a bit higher. Thanks, Ben. How's that? There he is, waiting for his little fish. Bless you. Shall we show people what you do? You're very clever. Oh, oh lovely. Thank you. And he has a little fish. Oh, was that nice? Oh. <laughs> there he is. There's Freddie. You lie down here with us, darling. Come and lie down. Come on, darling. No, he's um, a fair weather friend today. He'll come, he'll come in a minute. Oh, he's, he's off out into the garden. So we'll go off the Freddy cam. He'll come back. He's curious to see what's going on outside. It's a lot smoother, this operation. Thank you, Ben. And also, I'll never get it back to the same angle as I have before. Is that okay, folks? <laughs> How much does he weigh? Freddie weighs um, 30 kilograms. So what is, I know you do pounds, don't you? So what is 30 kilograms in, um, I'm not sure how I would convert it. He's not ready to lay down, Cheryl. No, no. He'll come. Do you want to come and lay down with us? No, Cheryl. He's a free spirit, isn't he? He's he's having a, he's been for a little walk. He's having a little wander. And um, yeah, bless him. So, oh, now are you all set up with coffee, Cheryl? Um 66 pound Ooh, wow okay so you said that abby was 30 pounds didn't you so he weighs double 
Wow. Gosh, thank you, Abigail. It's great to have the experts in. We have um, Janet, who's the expert in um, sending sending messages to the groups and at making ephemera. And then we have um, Abigail, who's a, a resident maths person. Oh, Nora weighs 47 pounds. Wow. One kilogram is 2.2 pounds. Oh, and Abby is 15. Oh, Abby. <laughs> oh, bless her. Yes, he'll come, he'll come once he um, later, Gerald. Yeah. Well, I'll just continue with this. But when you want me to go on to the mini book, just let me know. So in honor of Cheryl. Cheryl or Cheryl? Am I saying it wrong? Abby, um. Nora has doubled in size. Oh gosh, oh, no. And she's still growing as well, probably bear. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Wasn't it lovely? What a lovely, lovely bunch of people we've got in. <laughs> um there we are. So um what was I saying? Right, so yes, that's the stamp. And I will have to put it on a list. Shall I start making a list now? Making a list, like a professional streamer here. <laughs> there you go. Beth's got a huge list. I'm going to put to do, things to do. I've got people's favourite colours and things. And Oh, right. Carve a stamp. Yeah. Was I interrupted? I think I was. I was just going to, I was, did I say go back um, to Beth, Beth's stream for Saturday? Because that was fantastic. I loved it. And Beth was doing painting and her shoreline. Wow, it's brilliant. We had a day out at the beach, didn't we? <laughs> Nora is, is, yeah, and she's still growing. <laughs> and... Turn it over. This is ready to ready to put something on one of the tags. This one isn't for the swap though, because I don't tend to put metal things in if I'm sending them abroad, just in case they get damages the envelope. And here's a little page I did upside down for you, isn't it? We, ben, um, ben, we need to um, change the camera around some way, but I won't today because it's gaffer taped on. No pressure. <laughs> so um, I was lucky enough to get some colour photocopies. One's in Happy Mouth sending to Teresa. And I've got one over here for Melanie. And I put one in my in my book made a big tag what else have we been up to this week it's having a flip through it's all ready it's a blank canvas all ready to to fill i'm loving this we made an envelope in one of the streams and here's a little atc i made this week could make one of these if you like. I'll show you how I did this. Oh, Beth, just relax, yeah? Don't open your eyes, just listen for a while. <laughs> just relax. <laughs> We're all about relaxing. <laughs> I... I told you to put some sun cream, some sunscreen on, didn't I, Cheryl? <laughs> oh, thank you. You've had two cups of coffee already. Yeah, let's do an ATC, shall we? <laughs> now, what am I going to use? It depends what I've got out, really. Let's see. I'll just I'll put that journal to one side for the minute. We can come back to it and. Um, we're going to come to our little mini journal as well. 
don't forget our journals are called the little mini one and our little dangle one girls just want to have fun because that's what we want to do oh melissa's coming super <laughs> lovely right so yeah let's make an 80s shall we there we are i'll just get i've just got some scraps some bits and pieces let's have a look what we've got I've got this lovely print, peacock printout here. Use that. Just having a look through other bits and pieces I've got. There we are. Pop that, pop that to one side. And I need something cardboardy here. Let's have a look what I've got. I've just got something on my steps. Ew, this shiny one that I got. Got that in a, you have an onion soup box. Oh, brilliant. Is the onion soup box for your mini journal, Teresa? Yes, that would be super if you would paint one of those there. I love your painting. <laughs> oh. oh candy um i hope everything's okay let us keep you company on your way to the doctors and while you're um in the waiting room yeah brilliant well we're to keep you company brilliant isn't it lovely it's what comes to hand i think up here it, it is a shame to cover it up because it's shiny, but um, cover it up I will. I think I'll leave this side for the back and I'll cover this side up. So, oh, an 80, it's a little bit smaller than the ATC size, that one. I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what I'll do. Let me just go and get some cardboard out of the recycling. Unless I've got one here. I'll stand up because I don't want to reach over. I've usually got some um, ATC cards ready to... I've just had a really busy time making them recently. No, let me just go and get some cardboard. Is she walking along and tearing cardboard all at the same time? <laughs> I've got a box, so let's see. Oh, and I have got scissors, so um, I would imagine somebody lovely in the chat will be able to tell us the measurements. I'm actually just going to draw around this, like so. <laughs> to get mine. I'm wasting quite a bit of the cardboard, aren't I? But still, <laughs> it'd be nice. I can make a tag actually in a minute as well. Get my tags going for the swap. <laughs> in Beth's group, Beth's having a, a tag swap in her group. Right, so I just cut this out. Good luck at the doctors, yes. Oh, you need to find your gesso. Oh, that's frustrating, can't find it. Oh, I know, things get buried, don't they? Can you remember when you last used it? That's when I... Well, I'm not going to use gesso today. It, this card isn't that shiny. I'm not one of these that's going to put my hair dryer on or my glue gun. So, <laughs> oh, prayers being requested for myself, please. Going to eye doctor tomorrow. Catch her at consultation. Cheryl, yes, please, everybody. Sending prayers and love. Mm. Oh, 
Keep 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 us in touch with how how it goes and how you are. And Candy too, sending you our love. So I think with what I did with this one, I just made a background with the paper. So which one shall I keep? I think I'll probably just keep this blank. But sometimes I tend to do pictures on the back anyway. Oh, I haven't done anything on the back of this one yet. So I am just going to use my glue stick. Here. Yes, craft along or just listen. I know I've got um, Caroline, you'll be there. Wishing you all the best. I know you'll be listening. And my niece, Katie, might be listening too. It's been a bit wonky, but let's, let's start again. A little bit wonky. There we are. <laughs> oh, that's really nice, Teresa. Well, this is a lovely bunch. We're so lucky. Aren't we lucky? What a lovely bunch of people. It's lovely. All the way over in the USA. I've got Penny here. Um, Ten minutes down the road. Lovely. And Melanie... Melanie might be listening in the background while she works, actually. Oh, folks, just to say, our dear Melanie is working today. So, um, online working. So, she won't be joining us. We're going to miss her tremendously. But there's never any pressure for Melanie to come and join us. If she's not with us now, she'll catch up with us on the replay. <laughs> Candy, oh, it's your ankle, Doctor. And oh, it won't get better. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Candy. Very sorry to hear that. Hopefully, they can improve. Can they improve things for you, Candy? Thank you. It's pretty. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So, in here, let's open this. And this little girl here, she comes from a stamp. Isn't she pretty? It's lovely. Oh, thank you, Teresa. Hmm. Right, so let's look through what we've got. Ladies, please remember to give Janet a thumbs up. Oh, thank you, Janet. Thank you. Do you know, while we're on this thinking about people who are um, struggling a bit at the moment, um, can you keep in your love, prayers, whatever you like to say, can you, um, Jennifer Ann, I don't know whether you know Jennifer Ann from, I know her from Let's Make a Mess with Dawn. She, I'm sure she won't mind me saying that she's not been well at all and went into hospital. So just keep her in your love and your prayers too. That's Jennifer Ann. Now, Joy. She is here. She's editing and no pressure to be here. You're, you're just listening and, let, oh, bless you. Yeah. Oh, you're editing stuff. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Oh. <laughs> Melanie's working. She can't always be, can't always be with us on, at the table, can you, Melanie? Oh, Malaya. Jennifer is a, she, she is, she is, and I, I am actually thinking of her all, all day, on and off. Um, Jennifer and I met, obviously, online. We've been 
um, exchanging happy mail. I sent her happy mail because she wasn't well a couple of years ago. I never sent happy mail thinking I want something in return. Um, but she's a dear. Um, and yes, very much thinking of Jennifer Ann. Mel knows Jennifer Ann too from the group. I'm looking through the stamps as we're chatting. Let me show you, Malaya, something I've got here. I've got my afternoon tea here. Um, sorry, Melanie, dear. Uh, I make cakes. I've got some in the freezer for you. Jennifer Ann gave me this napkin. Isn't it adorable? Thank you, Beth. Cheryl, Teresa, thank you. Um, isn't it adorable? Mel and I, we shared a pink one and put it in a journal last year. But this one, I thought, I'm just going to keep and I'm actually going to use it as a napkin. And I think of Jennifer Ann when I, when I use it. <laughs> isn't it pretty? It's beautifully done. It's come all the way from America. And I certainly didn't expect her to send anything so thick and heavy because, you know, I only send tiny little happy mouths, as you'll see. <laughs> Isn't it lovely, Penny? I'm so lucky. <laughs> so I'll pop it there. I'll tell you about the cake later. <laughs> because we're busy. We're too busy making an ATC. Right, so. Oh, she would look rather nice on an ATC, wouldn't she? That's an English stamp. Let's put her there as a maybe. I, Laura calls this, she's got it from somewhere else, I think, auditioning. We're auditioning to see who's going to go on the ATC card. We're, going, we're doing auditions. Um, go through the stamps. I love these. I think I sent some of those to bear. Mm. Look at the pretty cupcake. I know. It's, oh, it's actually, um, ooh, that's rather nice. But I don't think fish goes that well with the peacock theme. Um, penguins. That's nice. That's for Laura. I'll put that there. I put things to one side. There's a bee here for Beth. I just, as I'm sorting through, I always put things aside. Um, say stop. <laughs> you like that? She's your first choice. I'm loving that. This is like a portrait. This, this, it's hard to see, but, um, it's, it says Renoir. It's a picture for a, a Renoir painting. And this is another painting. But maybe she looks a little severe. What do you think? You agree, Beth. Oh, you love the opera singer. And she's got pink. Shall I stop going through? You, you like that one. Oh, hold on. I can't resist showing you a few more. I have such an amazing collection of stamps. I'm so lucky. And Beth sent me some from the USA as well. <laughs> Look at her. What about her? Oh, there's two. There's two girls. And they're thinking. They're looking at you and thinking. Polska is Poland. Oh, I'm going to audition this one. I'm going to put her away because I think she's severe, just in case, because now Beth, oh, Beth, I didn't think you were meant to be having your eyes open yet. <laughs> oh, when we finish these, um, we can have a little draw in a hat or something. Uh, uh, and I, and we can, another penguin, another penguin for Laura. Laura likes penguins. <laughs> no, we need big stamps. Ooh, ooh, gosh. Probably doesn't go with the peacocks. 
Oh, Cheryl's changing her mind. It's a woman's prerogative, Cheryl. You can change your mind. Or oh, we've got a still life that can go on then. Isn't that gorgeous? Should we audition that one? It's just nice and relaxing, I think, for you or to um, look at the look through the stamps. Actually, sometimes if I'm feeling a bit, um, uh, what would be the word? Stressed, or I need to relax, or I can't do any art. Hello, Melissa. Welcome. So, if I can't feel like I can't do any art or gluing or I'm too tired. Sometimes I've got bigger drawers as well. I just love to look through the stamps and put some aside for different people. And Oh, look, Beth's going to make a cluster. Yay! <laughs> oh, maybe I should make it different to this one. Maybe this one I'll make a cluster. Oh, Beth, up there thinking, down there for dancing. That's what we say. <laughs> Penny, she's finding this so addictive, but have to go. Ta-ta, love. It's Penny needs to get on with the chores now. Penny, thank you. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Always lovely to see you. Um, and um, Penny, um we might have some requests that people might want to you to come and join the stream sometime as well, Penny. <laughs> oh, wow. You've got a box ready. Mooncake. Oh, what's mooncake? I've never heard of mooncake. We don't have that over here. How lovely. I want to know about the cake. <laughs> I'm being distracted by the stamps. I am being distracted because that is what I do. I find it if I either go through my button tin. This is a small button tin compared to a lot of the others. I, I, I find myself going through that or the stamps. See, I'm, I'm just relaxing. Yeah, okay, well, let's. Let's call it a day. Yes, let's call it a day. Cheryl's saying, come along now. You have to keep Beth in tow, don't you? She's saying, come along. Pop the lid on that. And let's have... If you see any of these stamps that you would like, just let me know and I can pop them in a little happy mail. <laughs> Moon pies. Are moon pies like um, marshmallow? Now I'm thinking. So which one were we going for? Are we going for, I can't write upside down, one, two, or three? Do you like what I did there? <laughs> which one are we going for for this? <laughs> They're old fashioned snacks, moon, moon, moon pies. Mm, lovely. I'm going to have to look that up online to see what they look like. Mm. Of course, I've got a little bit of a lag when you type something in. I'm not going to get it straight away. Um, have we any choices? One, two, or three for the choices? <laughs> I'm not a moon pie girl, but I like eclairs. Ooh, eclairs. Now, eclairs for us are shoe pastry. Cheryl. Now, 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 Cheryl. Now, Cheryl's going down a rabbit hole. Cheryl's thinking about cake. <laughs> and not stamps. I don't blame you. Did you know that moon pies are made here in Alabama? Oh, moon pies. Do you know, I'm going to, I, 
this? Is that like Chinese mooncake? Oh, look, let's go down this rabbit hole. I'm going to look up on my phone. Look at you. Um, I'm going to look up what they are. Moon pies, Alabama. Alabama. I'm looking it up. I'll show you. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay. Those are moon pies. I love moon pies. Now, I tell you what we call those. I used to have them when I was little. Maybe slightly bigger. And we call those wagon wheels. Do wagon wheels come from the States? Or is that an English thing? <laughs> Malaise say is someone giving out snack. Look. <laughs> oh, look. Um, Cheryl's gone for the healthy option, the carrots. Ooh. Oh, I'm not sure whether it's marshmallow or cream. Oh, um, hold on, hold on. Moon pies become became a traditional to throw at Mardi Gras. Ooh. In in Alabama in 1956. Oh, what I do ever followed by other communities along the northwest Florida and Mississippi Gulf Coast. Oh, wow. Do you throw them during Mardi Gras? Yes. And we, we, we have them like this, don't we, Melanie? And we call them wagon wheels. I love the way Melanie is joining in the chat. Excuse me, Melanie. I thought you were meant to be working. <laughs> can't resist it. I know, I know. can't resist it. Brilliant. Right. Shall I... Um, Shall I draw you back? Trivia time. I know. We could have like fun facts. You just looked up Mooncake USA, more like something we call wagon wheels. Yes, Melanie. Sorry, I'm I'm behind on the chat. Sorry, Melanie, darling. Mm. Oh, we'll have to have fun. We'll have to, oh, we'll have to, you can have moon pies and we'll I'll get some um. I'll just see if I can get on my shopping. I'll see if I can get some wagon wheels. It's for your book cover. Oh, I'm loving that. And um, Beth gave a lovely demonstration of how to do the um, book, didn't she, on Saturday? Oh, you had wagon wheels too. But the moon pies won over the wagon wheels. Oh, right. Okay. I think they got imported. You exported wagon wheels to us and they caught on. They used to be such a treat. We used to have them in the in the tuck shop at school. Oh, Teresa's got her base colour down on her book cover. We will go over to books, but um, for the minute we'll do our, um, our ACT. Bringing you back realizing I do have a lag maybe you're going to be voting for one two or three here Roman numerals here because I can't write upside down so yeah whichever you choose we can put on here we love it we love talking about the food don't we <laughs> naughty we're so naughty <laughs> Right, so I'm going to get some bits out because, yes, let's make a cluster. <laughs> Never heard of wagon wheels. <laughs> right, oh, I made a little file. This is just out of a file folder. Made a little for all those little bits and pieces so we can make clusters and tags. And I'm loving this. Two. Two. Ooh, right. Beth and Teresa say number two. Oh, that was people's first choice, wasn't it? Super. Hmm. <laughs> oh, number one. Cheryl says number one. Um, should we get a few more in as we get a tie? If not, don't worry, I'll make another one or I'll make a tag with them if we don't. Yeah. So I'm going to get some scissors. 
I wonder if Malaya, Malaya is at the doctor's yet, bless her. Because look, I just found this lovely one for Malaya. It says, you are brave. Isn't that lovely? That would be nice to put on um one that for Malaya. It would be nice to put that on um, one for Kendra too. Right, what have we got here? Let's have some fabric, shall we? What fabric's going to go nicely on here? If I put fabric on it, it's not going to send through the post. But maybe we could make one for... Um, oh, don't worry, Beth. People are just relaxing. People are just having a relax. Oh, look, ones I've already made. That's too small, that tag for the swap, though. Right, so having a little sort through here. Now, I think this green silk goes quite nicely. Oh, Moonpig, Moon Pie had the rights to the recipe, so Wagon Wheels had to go. I wonder where they're made now, the Wagon Wheels. Goodness, I will have to, um, maybe we bought the recipe. Hmm, interesting. So I'm just going to cut this. We're going to make a cluster. And the whole thing I think about making a cluster is just like going for it, not thinking too much. So we are, I think we've had more twos. But Cheryl said one, so I'm going to put that to one side. Remind me, Cheryl, and we'll put that on something for you. We'll make something later. Nobody wanted that one, so we'll put that one to one side. <laughs> so. Oh, Malay, you're still there. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, look, Malay, I found this for you. Can go on your ATC. You are brave. Mm -hmm. Janet, we showed the carrot in chat to say we are going down the rabbit hole. Ultra. <laughs> carrot, I thought you were having a healthy snack. <laughs> you girls, you went down the rabbit hole. <laughs> I'm loving that. Let's just find some more bits. I wasn't going to make a cluster, but I think that's a super, super, super idea. <laughs> Ooh, look, you never know what you might find in this little. Right. What else have I got to go on this cluster? I'm going to put some book paper down as well. Oh, lovely. You were outvoted. Yeah, but I'm still going to use yours. I'll make that for you. I'll put that aside. Just don't let me forget. You won't let me forget, will you, Cheryl? I know. There you go. I'm just putting things together. And I will, I'm actually going to stick this on, stick this one on. I think I need fabric tack. And, but I will do some sewing on it as well. And a nut for, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. <laughs> and a nut for squirts. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, dear. It, it, it's, um, it's like a different world, isn't it? <laughs> right, I'll stick the stamp on. I'm crafting along, um, Teresa. Freddie never came back, did he? Oh. He's not a loyal dog to us, is he? We'll take him out for a walk tomorrow. Squirrels. <laughs> Squirrels collecting nuts. Yeah, squirrel nut king. You got that from Dee Dee's chat, carrots. I'm loving that. <laughs> Aww. Now, do I need anything else on this? These painty papers, these are from Melanie. 
I just collect lots of bits and pieces. I'm sure you do. So for when we're making clusters or, um, ew, that's nice. That's not a Janet painty paper. That's a Maldroy painty paper. Yes. Ooh, lovely. Ooh, lovely. She's going to look fab, isn't she? It's going to be different to the other one, but that's not a problem. That's not a problem. It's nice to be spontaneous. <laughs> wow, Ben's um, at work somewhere. He's He's got other dogs today. He's working in an office. It's in a converted farm barn where he's working today. Uh, he's listening along to us. And there are dogs sit there. He, ben, Freddie goes with Ben to work sometimes. I'm sorting through here. There we are. That's another Meljoy painty paper. Pop that on. And I'm going to find a button and I'm going to sew a button on this too. Lovely. Really lovely. Have I got one in here that I want to use? Or do I need to? No, because I want quite a small one. This ATC is nice and flat. This one will send abroad. This one will be able to be sent to England. I could send one to Fran outside. Fran, what's Fran's name? Fran off the edge. Fran, Fran over the edge. Oh, Malay is folding laundry. Oh, no, we're, we're fine. Thank you, Malaya. <laughs> oh, Beth. Mm. Oh, Cheryl says if she could, she would. Oh, bless your heart. Oh. Um, oh, we have a story. I'm not sure whether Mel would tell the button story much better than me. Where do we get our buttons from? Wow. Oh, oh, that goes nicely with, that goes nicely because it's shiny. That is nice. I think I might choose that one. Um, where do I get my buttons from? Well, Maybe it was Melanie will chime in the chat, won't you? Um, if I get it wrong, let's just cut some of this off and we'll sew a button on. About a year ago, oh, you love that one. Thank you, Cheryl. <laughs> it's nice and shiny, isn't it? Let's see if the needle will go through. Oh, and it will. Oh, that's good. I'm going to put my glasses on, though. <laughs> there was some, on one of our local Croydon groups, just lick the end, there was a, a call, um, a post, and it said, our local button factory, where a button warehouse, I wasn't even aware that it was there because they... Uh, it was a warehouse. They supplied buttons all over Europe. And they they bought buttons from all over the world. I didn't even know they were there. It's a 10-minute walk from me. And they were closing down. And um, please correct me if I'm wrong, Melanie, dear, if I get any of this story wrong. What about ribbon? Ribbon! We can do ribbon. Yes. What about ribbon? Yes. Thank you. That's why you're there. Well, the ribbon that comes to hand is red. Do we have red on peacocks? Now we do. You, you just caught me in time, Cheryl. Well, yeah, it was a button. A warehouse is like um, a big place where they... Oh, 
so it was huge, massive, but it was on a residential road, a residential road I'd walked down opposite a cafe that I'd been having cups of tea in for a long time. And um, they, they were saying, they were saying they were closing down. And the post said, come and, and the family said, yes, it's okay. Ribbon, Cheryl, I'm doing ribbon. Any other suggestions will be lovingly accepted. Um, ribbon, loving that. Bringing out the gold in the button. Sometimes it's just nice to go for things and see what happens. How wrong can we? I know, Cheryl. Oh, it was just, I really wish at that stage I was of having the courage to to do some little vlogs. Oh, you would have loved it. When Melanie's here, she might explain it a little bit better than me, but let me tell you what happened. So there was a picture and it said the family, it was a family business, it was going under. They, then the family was saying, look, we, we can't get rid of all these buttons or sell them, We've got no way. So there's a skip, where skip is like a big yellow truck thing um like a big huge yellow box um and they can come and take it away so it's a skip we're just putting the buttons on the skip so if anybody wants to come round and collect any buttons please do so i messaged melanie melanie was working i messaged marion i think i messaged penny and I think I put something up in our Relax and Create group. And, um, yes, I went there and, Cheryl, you're a girl after my own heart. She loves, this is my other thing I do for relaxation. I look through the buttons. Don't get me started. And Melanie on button tins because we have quite a lot. And a jar. Oh, they're lovely in a jar too because you can see them. Yes, jars of buttons. Hold on a minute. I've got, oh, no, I won't get up because I was in the middle of a story. I can show you different buttons every time. Buttons candy. I love buttons too. Gosh, don't get Mel and I started on buttons. It's just we just love them. We've got so many different types. So many. They're quite light, but they're they're quite thick. So I can send them over, but not many. It is a soothing sound, isn't it? Get another coffee channel, don't fall asleep. <laughs> so anyway, let me tell you about um, the buttons. So I got my shopping trolley and off. I toddled with Freddie, bless him, um, to the button warehouse, which was about, well, about a 10 minute walk. And um, it does, it does sound lovely, doesn't it? If ever you're feeling that you don't want me to make anything, that you just want to look through buttons, just let me know. That's not a problem here. Um, let's put some Fabri-Tac on. So I, then I got to the button warehouse and there was the skip and there around it were lots of women, all very polite and being nice to one another and the family were coming out, putting vintage boxes boxes and boxes of buttons in the skip and they were saying oh just help yourself help yourself and we were saying thank you thank you and I said you used to play a um a game with buttons oh we we is it the same as hunt the thimble where you used to I used to play Hump the Thimble and Nana used to play that with the boys. Do you remember that then? Nana playing Hump the Thimble with you and she used to hide the thimble. Very old fashioned party game.
Teresa can't remember. <laughs> oh, it was a long time ago, you're right. I'm just going to fussy cut some of these out while we're chatting. Um, yeah, so I got to the um, button skip and it was it was surrounded by people and everybody was there. See, Ben does remember playing Hunt the Thimble. And um, we used to have metal thimbles, didn't didn't I? But then Nana, Nana never played by the rules and she always made a, re a mess. She got hold of the, um, I used to have a little collection of pottery thimbles, if you remember. And then I remember, you. is it still there? No, it's not. Through the keyholes in one of the wooden doors, I remember one of the boys pushing. He wouldn't go and broke the thimble and pushed it in. So funny. You could, oh, do you know, if you hadn't have said that, We'd have forgotten that, wouldn't we, Ben? Playing Hunt the Thimble with Nana. Love it. <laughs> hmm. Oh, yes, and it's a brilliant setup today. The camera's not going to fall on us. Um, yeah, so I don't think you ever got to see the button skip, did you, Ben? Probably despaired at me. Um, anyway, so um, I said to them, Thank you very much. And I was loading my trolley. I had little Freddie with me. And I none of the ladies were pushing or anything like that. Everybody was talking to one another. Some people had driven all the way across London, fashion students, and because they put a message out on Twitter about it. And people were getting buttons and collecting buttons. Every week I can show you different buttons. <laughs> oh dear, I can send you buttons too. Just a few. I'm quite happy to do that. <laughs> so um, I'll just cut these out. I I wasn't satisfied with that. I said to them, "Can I can I come in? I'd like to see the button warehouse." And this was just in an ordinary. Um, it was in an ordinary street in Croydon. You know where that cat is on the corner of Elizabeth's Road, Ben? It was ju it's just there. I don't know whether you came down with me. Probably tries to avoid doing that sort of thing. And, um, yeah, I went in there and they had, it went back for miles, rows and rows and shelves and shelves of buttons, all different types, all different sizes. Oh, show us, show us the button sample board. Oh, that would be fantastic. Thank you. I can get different bits and pieces down to show you next week, guys. Now we've started talking about this and so can Melanie. Um, so, oh yeah, it was, I didn't realize this, it went back so far. And in the skip as well, they were throwing out paperwork and I got a ledger and it, this ledger on one half, it said they were supplying buttons to England. And on the other side, they were supplying buttons to European countries. And, and this, I think the ledger we went back, some of the things went back to the 1940s that they were throwing on the skip. This is where some of this vintage paper, if ever I send you happy mail, I probably might be some of this paper in it. Um, where was it? There you go. Browns buttons. You can tell it's an old telephone number because it's just, well, it's got fax on it, but it's a very small number. Yeah, established 1919. Yeah. So, and and then um, they put they put the um. Some people collect thimbles, don't they, Candy? I don't know where those. I don't know where those thimbles are now. Um, so then they put out something on Twitter, 
and an artist from um so this if we didn't take the buttons off the skip they kept emptying the skip and bringing it back empty so they put out on it it went on the bbc news and also it went went out on twitter and a chinese artist contacted the button factory and bought the entire because there were thousands thousands of buttons just the ones on the skip were the tip of the iceberg really um so the next after a couple of days i went back to have a look and there were buttons scattered like snow all up the road just just and um i went back and it was like a different operation there were people there in with walkie talkies um and they were crating up all the buttons and there was a big lorry and they were going off to be part of an art installation the chinese artist had bought them so i mean that was a happy ending because it just meant and then play schemes and scrap schemes were were there um getting lots of lots of things from the lots of buttons from the from the skip so that is the story of how i come to have so many buttons and ben will tell you that this little travel suite tin is 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 um like so small compared to all the other all the buttons i've got and the tins i've got did, did i stick this down i don't think i meant to or did i oh well i stuck it down i stuck it down while i was talking and then i didn't i didn't realize i'd done it <laughs> there we are so let's just stick some of these i just cut some of these out So if ever you're making anything and you have a button need, just let me know. <laughs> I'm just cutting some more of these out, sticking these on. There we are. We've made an ATC. How nice. I'll put this one coming down here. Excuse me if you can't see. That coming over there. And that's... There we are. I'll put that coming over there like that. There. Does it need anything else? <laughs> So that is the story of the button factory. Years and years ago, there was a store in my town that only sold buttons. Oh, bliss. It was so cool. When the owner passed, that was the end of the store. Oh, a whole store for buttons. That's crazy. Oh, that's wonderful. I'm going to put some gold paint. So, yes, each week... Melanie or I could show you um, different, that's my gold paint, <laughs> different buttons that we've got. Hmm. And as I say, the paper was really good as well. Because that was not, I don't think it was going to be recycled. I think it was just going to go to landfill, so. We did a good thing. Yeah, there were fashion students there. And I would like to know, I have to look up that artist, because I did at the time, and to see if he has actually done something with those buttons. I will do that. Can't think of his name. It said he was a political activist, so I don't know what he was going to do with buttons, but 
nice touch thank you it's like um mary says she likes a bit of gold doesn't she <laughs> i'll just get a sponge hold on a minute hold on isn't that lovely though if we weren't chatting we'd have never thought about those thimbles Hunt the thimble <laughs> oh, I never. or as in your case hunt the button super hmm. oh buttons all sizes and shapes and I tell you what, if ever for anybody's stress, you could always say, Janet, come online, do a live, and um, just do the buttons for us, please. Oh, I did some dots. <laughs> Can you see that? Shiny. Gold makes everything good. <laughs> There we are. There. Loving that. And I'll put that there. Oh, there we are. I've got this. Hold on. This paper will become something in the end, won't it? There we are. Put that down there. <laughs> There. Is that enough? Is that finished? Let me just glue this bit down. Freddie dear, I hear him walking up the stairs. Do you know sometimes he just likes to come and sit on a nice cozy chair in the I'm sure if Melanie was here, he'd be here, wouldn't he? <laughs> there. Focus. What do you think? Is that there? That can be a hand delivered one because it's a little bit bulky. Thanks, Teresa. I love making ATCs, and Melanie does too. Really do. So, oh, see chat above. Oh, sorry. Okay, there's a website called Notions. They also show a warehouse in the UK. Really? Another button warehouse called Notions. Let me, let me write that down. Hold on, Cheryl. Sorry. Notions. Oh, I'll put button warehouse just in case I we digress. Button warehouse. You, well, I never... Hmm, oh wow. You didn't find any button warehouses in the States? Oh, they, the, the warehouse they supplied to all the shops and, yeah. And this little one, let's, um, let's send this away. Freddie and I will take a walk tomorrow and um, send this away, shall we? Would, who would, shall I put names in a hat? Is that the easiest way to do it? Because this one can fly all the way to the USA. <laughs> or, um, or wherever. Let's find an envelope. Have I got one? Yes, I have. I love. So if I do feel a little bit like I can do some art this is what I love to do just <laughs> stick stick bits of paper on very relaxing happy mail <laughs> this is pretty like a Monet hmm Would you like, um, we can do some glue book. 
We can. I'm going to use this bit of paint up here. Oh, and I'm going to use this bit of paint up and start the next thing. Ooh, I'm get, I like this. I'm getting in a mess on the desk. That's good because that's what I'm used to. Maybe I should put some of these bits away, but I just don't feel like tidying up yet. Oh, this is dry now. There's the violet card with all the violets on. I think it might look a bit busy. I'm not sure. Happy mail. Yes, I'm going to send some happy mail. How do we choose? Um, shall I draw names out of a hat like we did last time? I'm going to put that in there. That can go. Oh, thanks, Teresa. I didn't know whether it was too busy, but they're the violets that we had from the pressed flowers and the napkin. Yeah, oh, thanks. Glue's dried now. So this leftover paint, I'm just going to open. I'm waiting for you to tell me what to do with the happy now. Um, Colour coordinated. <laughs> it is by Violet, yes. I should send that to Violet in Bibspell. <laughs> I might do, I might just do that actually. Um, here's my little mini book. My girls just want to have fun book. Pick from a hat. Um, I will, just before I do that, I'm not going to, I will, I'm just going to use this bit of paint up. We'll come to this book in a minute. And where did I put Camilla? Ew, I'll use this one. This is my travel texture kit. I shall just do this in here just while I don't want to waste this paint. Just do this and then I'll just use the rest up on there. No, oh, it's still coming off. It's just strange, doesn't it? Lovely, lovely, lovely. I shall come to that in a minute then. The little book is cute, I know. <laughs> I will come to that in a minute. I'll just let that dry. And then what, pick names out of the hat. Right, super, lovely. I should have all these names on a stick, shouldn't I? I should have all your names already. And then just add, I think I might do that actually. Yes, while Candy's still here, because there'll come a point when Candy gets to the doctors. Candy, Cheryl, Bear. Should we put Ben in? I think Ben will probably prefer to win a uh, cake or something. <laughs> Beth wants me to glue a stamp in this book. Right. Yes, I certainly will. Ooh, that one's for Cheryl, isn't it? That one there. But yeah, we'll find, we'll, we will. Thank you. Remind me if I forget, please. Leaving doctors now. Oh, Candy, you've had your appointment already. Oh, okay. I do hope that went well. I love it. Candy's been with us all this time. I'm loving that. Teresa. Teresa. Love Janet. And we've got Melissa. Melissa, you're there. Melissa, are you busy gluing in your book? Candy. Oh, I've got candy there yeah, already. Um, don't let me forget people, please. And people that just popped in. Oh, Penny. Oh, I've already got one for Penny. Penny's already got happy mail because she lives around the corner. Crumb cake for Ben and a cookie for Freddie. Yay! <laughs> Let's put Freddie's name in. I'm going to call Freddie back down again in a minute. Because you girls, you, Beth, you haven't seen me yet this morning. You haven't seen my Freddie cam. Oh, we're all set up over here. Oh, just give give us... Um, <laughs> we should pass the book around and put something in it. Oh, 
Fran, you've got a headache. I am so sorry to hear that. Bless you. Just writing your name down there, Fran. I'm so sorry. Take a tablet, Fran, and um, drink plenty of water. It is quite muggy today, isn't it? Do you know, Cheryl, I love that idea, and it's called something, isn't it? Is it called a round robin where you do that? But that sort of thing makes me quite anxious. That's why I like happy mail. And I do tend to get a little bit nervous of swaps because um, Candy, Cheryl, Beth, Teresa, Janet, that's USA Janet, not me, <laughs> and Fran. Anybody else? Don't let me know. Oh, Fran, it is just frustrating. And you were meant to be doing your first stream as well. And now you've got a headache. Take some water and you've probably been overdoing it, haven't you? Yeah, you do have a busy, you have a busy life, yeah? If we can, oh, yes, I have got Janet USA. Thank you. Abigail, yes, thank you. Thank you. It's not because I forget look I'm glad you said something Fran because look people are really rooting for you and thinking about you yeah yeah it, it's, it is a shame because you were on a high last week Fran doing your um, printing and we really would like to come over to one of your lives too Tracer understands Thank you for understanding. Oh, you've had a PC stream failure. Oh, you were trying to do your live and it hasn't gone well. Well, my first attempts didn't go well, did they, Beth? And Beth used to say to me, actually, I was trying and I was on FaceTime with Beth and Beth was saying to me, just keep trying, Janet, you're one click away. Have a rest for today, Fran. Oh, uh, have a, oh, Lord, have the tablet first. Sit, have a rest, see how you feel, see how you go. Oh, I'm disappointed for you. I'm sorry that that didn't work out because you must have been excited about that. Send something to Jennifer Ann. Yes, I'm writing a list, please. Yes, let's. Sent. Jennifer Ann has had, Malaya has been in here, Malia has been in here. Um, Jennifer Ann has had trouble with her mail during this um, COVID situation because um, they were holding it all at the front desk. I don't know whether they've um, sorted that out, but I'm happy to take the... I'm happy to take the chance. I am. Jennifer Ann. I'm making myself a little list there. Do some things. Yeah, Jennifer Ann. I'll put that there. That's for Cheryl. Yes. So I hope, have I got everybody now? Do you know, we all just need a lot of us that aren't feeling well or struggling. We just need something gentle, don't we? Just, yeah. I'm going to get the hat. And what's the prize did I say? Where is it? Now the desk is, oh, here it is. It's this and some other bits and pieces that you choose from the desk and stamps and bits. <laughs> that stick is going to fall off. I need to put some more bits on it. Yep, let me just go and get a hat. <laughs> Where are you, please? Yeah. No, he's not even in the lounge. Freddie sits up at the window watching the world go by. <laughs> Am I going to get gold on my hat? I taught myself to crochet. <laughs> So let's put the names in that hat. I haven't got a Meljoy to help me this time. No pressure, Meljoy. Don't worry. I'm doing all right. 
So I'm going to mix them up. Now yeah, take a tablet pan. Oh. I'm just shuffling them up here. Right, there you go. And I shall put it up like that. And I should just pick a name. Oh, thanks. I taught myself online to crochet. Little Sister Cheryl is going to make a cluster card. Yay, it's Day of the Clusters, isn't it? I think I might make another cluster to go in my mini book. Oh, oh, this wool, Ben, you sent, Ben, oh, Ben went to Canada and he went to Walmart and he bought me back this wool, didn't you? And it was in one one ball and I think they called it like a cupcake. He said he bought me back this because it was unicorn colours and I made a scarf and a hat. Yeah, Ben bought me this. I taught myself online so if you need if you can't crochet and you want to to learn i can recommend this person's channel thank you cheryl because it does get cold here and we need hats yes yeah, so thank you ben if you're still here this wool was from you i loved it i loved using it especially because it was from ben i'm just doing the names Oh yeah, it made Ben. It made um, a hat and a scarf. I love it. Thank you. Very thoughtful. <laughs> Out candy remembers Ben. No, Ben did bring me back some composition books. Yeah, the one, the the black one. Yeah, didn't you, Ben? And then some other ones. And when he was in the shop, he he. God bought a box of donuts in Walmart, didn't you? And you spilled um, sugar on the um, composition notebooks. No, no, you did. And I shared the, some of the composition books as well. I'm just fiddling with these. Ben, yes, please. Go back. It's Yes, go back to Canada, Ben. That's a good excuse. I'll give you a shopping list. <laughs> and, and I love this wool. Right, so I'm just fiddling with them. I can't see them at all. As you can see, look. I'm putting my hand in there, so it's all fair. So I've, I've picked one out now. I've shuffled them around. So many times. Look, you can see how fair this is. It's coming out. And Melissa, how lovely. I'm going to send this to you, Melissa. Now, maybe Melissa's here at the moment, or maybe she's in the background. I'll save those names for another time. I have a different hat every week. <laughs> oh. Oh, Teresa, I'm sorry. Oh, oh that is frustrating. Joe jo wants to, me to go on the big telly. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. I listen to you on the big telly sometimes, Beth. I love it. Feet up. <laughs> I'm sorry, Teresa, that you, you, that you can't do that anymore. That is frustrating. Mm. Hi, Joe. <laughs> oh. oh, don't let me forget. Yes, Melissa. I can't get, is it just me? I can't get the, um, let me write something on there. Um, I can't get the address labels to work. The addresses in Beth's group or Fibsville, so it's hard. Has anybody else had that problem? Melissa, I know Beth will be able to pass the address on to me kindly. I think Beth and um, Beth said there were things happening with. Um, there you go. See, this is my list of things to do. I've got Jennifer Ann. And Cheryl wanted that one. So, what are we up to now? Let's get to our little book. I love this. So, my, my big one, 
I'm going to call this My Girls Just Want to Have Fun because this is the one I put all the dangles on. Thank you, Beth. Beth's going to get me the address. Thank you. Ah, oh, thank you. And I will send that. I have actually been saving things for Melissa somewhere. I have little piles of things because I I came across the other day some horse stamps and some horse pictures, so I'll pop those in. So this is my girls just want to have fun book. We'll do something else in that in a minute. And this is my little one that I was inspired to make by Cheryl. Cheryl and Beth, they used, um, you're here, aren't you? Sorry. You used a cream cheese box, a Philadelphia cream cheese box. We have that over here, don't we, Ben? We love it. Um, but I wasn't going shopping, so I just went in the cupboard, little sausage dog, and um, found a little old playing cards. <laughs> Cheryl's here. I said your name. <laughs> you inspired me, didn't you, to do this? So I made a little mini book. This can be my little mini girls just want to have fun. Sanna, hi. How are you, Sanna? You had a headache the other day. Um, and I put material on the inside. I'll put it this way for you. Material on the inside. I just used Mod Podge and Mod Podged the material on. And I put one signature, just of little tiny bits and pieces and scraps, one signature. Now, Beth used a hairband on hers or elastic. Good. I'm glad, Sanna. Good. I hope that you're well and creating. And Ah, oh, Melissa, I put the names in a hat of people... Um, that were here. I know you were there in the background. And I'm sending you some happy mail. I took, I put names in a hat and I drew out your name. And I'm sending you the ATC card I made the other day. And it says fabulous on it. Just fabulous. <laughs> and I've, I've got some other bits and pieces to put in there for you too. But it, it'll only be little and light. I shall post that. Freddie and I will go out for a walk and post that for you. So congratulations. Mm -hmm. Oh, Cheryl's grabbing some wax linen thread. I've used some wax linen thread, but equally so. What Beth, what Beth said, a nice hairband over there just to keep the signatures in or some elastic, whatever you want to do. You've got ink tense blocks today, but don't know how to use them. OK. I haven't got any here to demonstrate. Can anybody tell Sanna how to use ink tense blocks? Teresa and Malaya are still doing laundry. We're keeping you company, yes, while you're working and busy. So, yeah, I'll just give you a little flick through. It was already some painty paper that I used. A vintage book, but you don't need much. It's just the little scraps. I folded that one over so I've got like a little tucky thing there. Ink tents. Um, oh, they're like watercolour. Okay. Wow. A bit like Distress Ink. And I've already put some washi tape on because I, I usually have a little um, book on the go. I can't resist working in little books, actually. 
And this is a ticket I think I made a while back. I think that's a handmade ticket. I think, was Lizzie doing those? And that goes in there. And I just used painty paper and I, I made a, a flip, a flip out. A little teapot there. That was a little piece, a tiny piece of napkin. You don't need much. And made a little, folded it over, you see. And, and this is waiting now for something else to go on it. I made a little pocket there. Tiny little page, we can put something on that. There's the other bit. I've already been sticking some bits down. And that. Mm -hmm. Oh, a flip out, I know. <laughs> really getting fancy. So if Jersey was here, you have a flip and then a flop. You do another one, I might do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, so Cheryl's saying you put some of the ink down on paper and then you lightly wet them or spray maybe. Have a play, have an experiment while you listen along. And let us know. We'll post some pictures in um, Beth's group and then we can see. I can show you what you want. I am so sorry that I didn't realise I hadn't. Yes. Thank you, Cheryl. Thank you. This was your idea to make a girls just want to have fun book out of a box. If anybody else wants to do one, let us know if you're having any problems. Um, go to Beth's stream. I think it was this Saturday and she was demonstrating how to do it, weren't you, Beth? Here we are, Melissa. There'll be some other bits inside, but I made you an ATC. And it says fabulous. Got some peacock feathers. And this is a stamp. <laughs> Ink intense. Ah, intense. <laughs> Says Cheryl. Cheryl's doing the rhyme. <laughs> You've covered it and you'll work on it again tomorrow. Yes. So go to Beth's stream for Saturday if you want some tips on making your small, your small book. Yes, you've cut it out and covered it. So you can use wallpaper or painted papers like Beth, or you can Mod Podge material or pop the cluster on, whatever, whatever you want to do, because there is no right or wrong. Now, would you like me to make another cluster or would you like me to make one of these little paper clips? <laughs> What would you like me to do? While you're doing, while, the, while I'm waiting for the lag, I might have to pick some of these out. I'm trying to get to the little, I like the little flat buttons. I like the little mother of pearl ones. Oh, look at that mother of pearl one there. It's so vintage, the little holes there. I will, Freddie and I are going to walk to the post box, post it in, and it's gonna come all across the Atlantic Ocean, all the way to you, Melissa. You like the, cu the card cluster. Right, okay, let's do a cluster. We still need a button for a cluster. I think I might go for that one. That is gorgeous. It's very, very vintage. Yeah, let's make clusters. Um, do you know, I can't see where I put it now. Oh, there. Um, Yes, to make clusters, just empty a whole load of bits on your desk. <laughs> oh, look at this tag. This is a lovely tag. 
that was from Melanie. I'm going to put that in there and we will do that up another day. I'm going to make a cluster to go in my little mini book right next to the teapot. <laughs> these ones away oh look at these ones they, oh sorry dear little things still on the string there's a come from someone's button button box in the past i was lucky that button will look good with a bow oh i'm glad you reminded me of that because i don't usually do that remind me and I will type bow, yes, thank you. Um, where I worked at the, the centre, the dementia centre, doing crafts and different things with everybody and singing. And, um, some lovely silk, beautiful silk. Um, one of the ladies there, she was a volunteer. And um, she was a retired lady and she gave me her mother's button box. Can you imagine that? She said she wasn't using it anymore. And she said she knew that I liked to do craft because I used to take my button box for um, people under supervision to just in case people swallowed things. But so they could do sort through the buttons and she gave me her mother's button tin wasn't it it was so lovely of her with full of vintage buttons from the 40s and 50s i was so lucky i'm on the tv <laughs> Beth, you explained it well. Thank you. Oh, Malaya's making a cluster. Oh, you're making clusters tonight on a live stream with a bunch of awesome ladies. Oh, um, Malaya, if I if I make you um if I make you blue, for, oh no, uh, sorry. I thought, oh, I don't want to see. This is my this is my oh, make a moderator. No, I. I don't want to click on anybody and remove them by mistake. That's my, can I make you a ad moderator, Malaya? And then would you add a link uh, maybe to your channel and then we can all follow you tonight. That's lovely. Trace is saying, how are you darling? I like the way you say darling. Kentucky slang, Joe. Mm -hmm. If you can, Malaya, I think I've made you a moderator. Um, and you, that means that you can pop your link and we can join you making clusters tonight. What fun! What fun! You're going to be making a mess like this. <laughs> oh, I like this one. That's lovely. Now, this isn't one of my painty papers. It's actually, that's too nice to cut up. I'm actually just going to stick. I love keys. Absolutely love keys. So now I'm going. Oh, I'm on a roll now. That, that having stuff around and clusters, it's, it's very freeing, I think. Just put some paint there. I'm loving this gold today. Maybe it's because it's the only paint that's at hand. I don't know. Just going to put some of this around here. And I'm just going to put this key straight in here. I wonder who sent me this. Thank you to anybody that sent me that. That is going to go in there with that key when that's dry. I've got this. I'm not going to waste it. Where shall I put it? Just around this edge here. I love a little book. They just come together and I don't know. You can just put it there and you can use all your little bits and pieces in it. There you go. Well done, Cheryl. 
brilliant idea. Right, so we all make things differently, don't we? I'm auditioning things at the moment, putting things out and on just to see what I like and see what goes together. Oh, this is some of my eco paper. This is this, the one that you boil. This is from last, this time last year. I didn't squash it, I boiled it. I like this better. It's very rough and rough and ready. I love that. And we're going to put, did we say we were going to put stamps on the cluster? I think mm. that's what we said, isn't it, there? I know you wanted stamps to go in this book. Oh, good. Um, have I subscribed already, Malaya? Oh, I can go over on my phone, actually. Yeah, so hopefully we're going to get a notification. Yes, what time, Malaya? Let me... Oh, no, I need to follow the link, don't I, on the, on the chat. There we are. I hope you didn't mind me making you a mod, um, Malaya. Oh, Malaya, I'm not subscribed. Am I on the right channel? Vintage Rose Creations. And I'm pressing the bell too, so I get notifications. Did I go through to the right link? Oh, go over and have a look. So pretty. Vintage Rose Creations. Oh, Ben's just sent me a photo. Oh, Ben's just sent me a photo. Look, that's all the little dogs at work. Oh, Ben, you need to take Freddy next time. Freddy would have loved it, but I know Freddy wanted to be here to be with the girls today, didn't they? And then where does he go? He's off. <laughs> right, so I've got purple thread, so let's go for that. I might have to watch the replay. Oh, okay, Malaya. Malaya. Where, whereabouts do you come from, Malaya? Have you been over to the channel? It looks beautiful, really lovely. Melissa, dear, have you got a channel? You're in the USA, Malaya. Right, okay. Mm. Oh, lovely. Well, I will. I'll watch it if I'm, if I'm not up. If, if things are in the middle of the night, I tend not to. I, ha I can have them on in the background, but I tend not to. Um, I've just got some more snippets over here. <laughs> um, I tend not to react if it's at night because I think, oh, I should be relaxing and going to sleep. But I love to have things on in the background, though. Put that there. Got some more sari silk there. I've made it pink. Oh, okay. Care Heart. Oh, yes. Okay. That's the Disabled Artist Foundation. If you want to pop a link in, um, to that, please do. We'll link away. <laughs> Fran, how's your head? I hope the tablets are kicking in a bit. And sometimes the frustration of um, online stuff can... Sorry, I wasn't doing that in frame, was I? Online stuff can make you feel like that, can't it? A bit frustrated. How many things, when you make a cluster? Yes, 
Sorry, when I pause, I'm reading the chat. The Carolinas. That's in the South, isn't it? Yes. So, yes. I've got, how many? I've got sari silk, some paper, two more pieces of silk and that. Is that enough? I'll pop the button on there. I love making clusters. I made a mini book before and just filled it with clusters. I love to do that. I am in VA and Malaya is living in the Carolinas. Oh, it's hot, is it, for you at the moment? Four hours away. VA, VA is, oh, you'll have to remind me um, what that means. There we are. Now, I don't usually do this, and Beth reminded me to do this. To You mean to tie a bow in the button? Is that what you meant? Ooh, near the sea, near the coast. Oh, it's Virginia. Yeah, 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 I knew that. Sorry, I'd forgotten. Of course I knew you were there. Um, yes, tie a bow. Is that what you meant, Cheryl? Because sounds lovely. There you go. There. Bit fiddly diddly. How are you feeling now, Beth? Are you coming too a bit? Had one cup of coffee, maybe two. Oh no, that didn't take. Oh well, no, that's fine. I'm going to accept it to that. It's not a full bow, but I don't mind. And I will just chop it off. Like that. Beth, I love that idea. Thank you. Oh, Fran, Fran. Oh, bye. Bye-bye, Fran. Really hope you feel better soon. And I keep keep in touch with us and tell us um, how you're going with the live streaming and getting things sorted because we do want to come over and join you. Thank you, Sana. Feel better soon, Fran. I know you have a busy time. So, yes, I love that. And I'm literally just going to stick it in here. I like these little books because some, um, is this dried? This, yeah, that's dried. I'll just stick this in. Uh, I like these little books because they're nice to go in pockets and they're nice just to, I usually give them away and people can, you know, I said the glue wasn't working and now it is. Oh, Sana, how are you getting on with those ink tents? Anything to post yet on Beth's group to show us? I shall put that key in there and we'll start a little key collection. I've got a little key charm that I can put on that. Bye, Fran. Turn this upside down and we'll stick this on a page. Is this to go in the little book? Is, it, is this to go in this mini one? Is that okay here? Or here maybe? I like things dangling over the edge. Is that good in there? Or did you think a bit more for the big book? I'll put some glue on it while I'm waiting for the lag. Oh, Beth, Therese, Teresa, can you help me? How do I post Melissa's? Facebook page. Oh, how do you share it? Oh, yes, you helped me, so hopefully. Um, you've made swatches and one colour. I'm not sure what I'm thinking of them. Need more practice. Yeah, well, it's practice and playing, isn't it, Sana? Yes. Have a, have a little 
play around? Will they be nice for stenciling? Sana, the ink tents. What do other people use their ink tents for? Going to post the link in the chat. Post away. What fun. So, maybe you have the wrong kind of paper. Ooh. Well, advice, people. Yes. Ah, Melissa, you knew it was Virginia. You know your states. There. I'll push that in there. And so it flips like that and like that. I think we should do a, a flippy floppy. That's what, that's what the Jersey crafter would do. Let's make a flippy floppy. <laughs> just this was a coloring book and I gessoed it and then just sprayed it and it's it's nice oh well done there you go you got there nice work <laughs> nice work girls I'll just sellotape this on well done, if you follow the link, that's to Melissa's Facebook page. Is there any way you can make your um, Facebook page not public, um, Melissa, dear? Because Beth's Facebook page is a private Facebook page, so when we post pictures on there, not everybody sees them, you know? Sometimes you don't want everybody to see all your work. So I just made a flippy, floppy. <laughs> there you go. The Jersey crafter would be proud of me. Mm, I'll just reinforce that a bit. Oh, no, I might do that later with some fabric or something. So that goes over there, and I just need to sometime put something on there. Wow. <laughs> oh, Cheryl, what are you doing? What, what are you crafting? Lovely. Now, would you like me to make the little, do the little paper clip or do you want me to keep on making clusters? What would you like me to do? Are you doing more things in your book, Cheryl? Thank you, Beth and Tracer. Do, yes, do follow that. That's the link to Melissa's um, Facebook group. There we are. I'm just, I'm literally just grabbing them. If you see um, Lizzie, Lizzie Brewer, she says, don't think about it. Just grab things, pop them on. So, get some of this. And we'll get a little stamp. Look, I'm going to do the first one I see. It says Era, which is Ireland, and it's a little blackbird. Cute, <laughs> cute, cute, cute. I think I need another colour of some sort on there. Oh, showcase, look for the. <laughs> right, so, um, oh, 
This is nice. Use some of this. I think the nice thing about making these clusters is you don't have to throw all the little bits and pieces away. You can use everything up. Snip. That's quite a relaxing sound too, isn't it? The snip. I'm just going ahead and making another cluster. And when you want me to make a paper clip, the paper clip, just let me know. I think I might make another button with a bow actually. Cheryl can't chat now, she's too busy, aren't you? She's busy making her little book. <laughs> right, so I need little, I like little buttons because it's Ooh. Okay, have a rest, Sana. I'm watching your videos, they've been lovely. Have a break and have a break and play and gather in inspiration. You can't really see this, but this is this is fabric and it's absolutely lovely. But I don't want to put that on because you can't appreciate it very much because you can't see it. Oh, I love this one because it's just so unusual. It's oval. That's nice. I think I might put that on unless anybody screams out and says, no, don't do that. <laughs> right, where did the needle go? Did I not put the needle back in the pincushion? It was a bit silly. Um, oh, well, I'll get another one and that will turn up. Let's see if that goes through. Yes, it does, because some of the holes get quite small, don't they? You can't use them. What other ones? Oh, here you go. I've got some purple thread. A little lick. Scalloped. Thank you. Yes, it is a scalloped button. Thank you. Thank you. Our resident expert here. Thank you. Hmm. I should just make another one. Do you know, Beth, when I very first started watching you, you're, it's going back a good few months, maybe last year, you were going through a phase and you used to make a cluster at the beginning of each stream. Do you remember that? Obviously, you've got so many other things on your list now. and That was a lovely little phase that you were going through. So maybe I could make that my phase. Just a little rummage around the button tin. Oh, I can't, I don't seem to be able to get the needle through. I'm, oh, there you go. I'm coming up to make another bow in this one. Sometimes it's nice to have a break and just have a play and Sano and that's that. See if I can tie this one in a bow. More fingers and thumbs. <laughs> Got the little needle here and I'll pull it through. During December was it? Yes. Yes, you get some crafting done. Oh, you're going to make a journal. Super. A junk journal. There you go. Oh, I actually made a bow this time. I shall showcase it. Oh, hold on. Let me just make that a little bit smaller. 
this one. Ooh. Oh, that was lovely there. I love the interaction of being online because I don't usually do that with a bow. I always sew them, but I don't usually do a bow, so thank you. Oh, am I covering his little head up? Hold on. Oh no, sorry. His head, I'm not covering his head up, his head is there. If you can see it, it's a little, little beak. That is more sweet. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm a member of your Facebook group, um, Melissa. Right, now, shall I put this one in the mini journal or shall I put it in my other one? You let me know. And while you're letting me know, I've just got one more little page to do in here today. I saved this out of a magazine and it's the lady dancing in a red dress. Thank you, Beth, for doing the posting. So I'm going to stick her in this little journal because I think she's very cute. I've just got something over here. Hold on a minute. This gets up. <laughs> Can I find it? Can I find what I'm looking for? That. Can I find what I'm looking for? No. I've got I have a stamp cutter. But no. I'm not like Beth. Beth can always put her hands on things, can't she? Beth is our hero. <laughs> Beth always knows where things are. I don't. <laughs> I was going to make it into a stamp, but um, I can't do that. Have they got any down here? Hold on. Sometimes I have. No. Sometimes I cut them out. Some, if you've got crinkly scissors, you can make a make a stamp. But I haven't got crinkly scissors. I usually just use my... I will find it when we finish. I can show you next week. Oh, she's lovely. She's lovely. Look at her dancing. Isn't that lovely? I might draw on her face and, oh, I think my fine pens are upstairs in my bed, in, in the bedroom. <laughs> From being on stream with Beth on Saturday, I have bits and bobs up there too. So I'm not like Beth, I can't put my hands on everything all the time. <laughs> there you go. I can always make this into a stamp shape when I find my little stamp cutter. Oh. She is sweet. A little dancing girl, and I'm just going to. Oh, when I when I made this up, I sewed the pages in and I put them in upside down. So I undid it. <laughs> Silly me. I'm just gonna stick it anywhere. I'm not gonna think. I'm literally just gonna glue. Because I just don't think you can go far wrong with something like this. Use your pen to make a stamp. See, as I say, up there, up there for thinking, down there for dancing. Isn't 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 she good? Yeah, make use your pen. Good idea. I shall frame it in red. Well done. Thank you. You'll be right back, Melissa. Yes, yeah. Draw the stamp on. Yes, Beth, I will. Good idea. I need a bit of scrap paper. I thought I'd put some scrap paper out. Oh, well, never mind. 
I'll just go, oh, this is my scrap paper here. <laughs> Draw around it, yes, good idea. Yes, we don't all, we don't have to have lots of fancy equipment, do we? Pen, scissors and a glue stick. Oh, I'm loving that. Thank you, Beth. What a poppet you are. <laughs> Absolute poppet. There you go. Rough and ready, but it does the trick. A stamp. Thank you, Beth. Oh, Sherry. Hi, Sherry. Nice to see you. And someone's saying, and Janice. Oh, Sherry and Janice, welcome. Welcome, welcome. We're here. What are we doing? I'm working in my little mini journal made from a box. It was Cheryl's idea. And um, we're calling it Cheryl's idea too. We're calling it Our Girls Just Wanna Have Fun book. And we've just been a bit of a cluster, popping that in. And this was just a little, little picture. And we just made a little stamp by scalloping the edges. Best idea. <laughs> oh, you're at work, Janice. Oh, brilliant. You're sneaking in. Ben's at work and he's listening to sneaking in. Yes. Brilliant. I need to put, I need to find somewhere a little number and stick that on that stamp. This is, I love it when, when you just, one gets creating and you say, oh, I'll just do this and I'll just do that. Cheryl says, here. <laughs> I said your name. <laughs> but you're busy. Get on with it. <laughs> Haven't got time to chat. You're too busy. <laughs> there we are. And then, so I've put like a little number from a page from a book for the money. Sneaky, sneaky, crazies. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, it's lovely. Yes, it's always good to use recycled things, isn't it? And paper. Most of the things I do are made out of bits and pieces and scraps. And um, Sherry and Janice, if you want to, um, I don't know. Did you see Cheryl, um, Beth making her book out of a Philadelphia cheese box and she covered it. So if you need any help with making that, you can go there. I do, Sana, I like to make things. It's, um, it's, it's, not a draw front, I don't think. I just um, opened out the card box, playing card box, and I collaged with material onto it. And I just stitched in, where is it? Where's the middle now? I've lost it. I've stuck it somewhere. The... I sewed in a little pamphlet stitch signature, but Beth has used a hairband, which I think is very sensible, and just slipped her signatures in. Oh, you're making a bunch of books. Fantastic. And then they're great to have a book, and then you can, you've got them to work in and play in. Yeah, no, good idea, Janice. Oh, Malaya um, uses all recycling stuff. You're making book page flowers right now. Oh, Malaya, that sounds lovely. Maybe we'll see that on your stream tonight. Malaya's streaming tonight. Pop in your link um, for Janice and Sherry. Um, as, please, Malaya, if you want to. 
and then they can join you. That's it, cardboard boxes and cereal boxes, Santa. Yes, that's what we do. Brilliant. I'm all for that. I'm just going to stick these in and then we'll decide what else we want to do. I'm sticking these in here unless someone tells me otherwise. It's probably be stuck in because of the lag by the time. Taking your taking your wax linen apart using a single thread. Oh, mine is only a single thread. Oh, okay. You can get ones that are thicker. Oh. Yes, you can throw something. Or you can just recycle. Yeah, you can put it in the recycling. Yeah. Sherry uses quacker boxes. Ooh, I found the needle. I'm going to be disciplined and put it in there. So, yeah, I'm just going to stick that cluster in there. And this was Beth's idea to make a little bow on it. And it just goes in there. Can't keep it all, no. Oh, Teresa's going. Oh, bye. Oh, Teresa, bye bye, darling. Always so lovely to have you with us. Thank you. Thank you for all your participation as well. Have a good day. Yes, I like working with bits and pieces too. Look, I've just, I just emptied it out onto the desk and I'm just sort of like looking through and it's very inspiring, isn't it? Just to, yeah, definitely. Now, what would you like me to do next? I can do some paper clips or some more clusters. Oh, I need to stick this in. Or am I saying I've been here quite a long time? Are you guys wanting to get on with other things now? Ooh, I stuck this all the way down. It could have become a corner tuck, couldn't it? Never mind. I'm going to pop that little homemade stamp in. Bye, Teresa. Hold on. Is what's happening? I'm not keeping up. Thank you. Thank you for saying it's cute. Mm -hmm. Kathy, hello and welcome. Welcome, new subby. <laughs> How did you get to hear about us? You're very welcome. We're here and having a good old chat. And Can you show your corner pocket? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Good morning, Kathy. I'm saying good morning. It's morning for you. It's afternoon here. <laughs> I'm going to show my corner pocket. Oh, wouldn't it be fun to make a mini corner pocket for this little mini book? And before I go, um, I do I do remind me to show you. Um, I've got another journal, and it's called a micro journal, so it's smaller than this one. Oh, let me. Let me keep up with this. <laughs> oh, Kathy, people are saying hi to you. We're a really welcoming bunch here. Thanks for um, hopping into the chat and saying hi, but don't feel under any pressure to chat or you're unhappy. You know, just, just whatever makes, whatever helps you relax in the day <laughs> or helps inspire you do your art. You might be doing some art and listening at the same time. Sherry, if I, shall I make you a moderator and then you can um, drop your page, yeah? Add as a moderator, I'm getting quite good at this now. There you go. Tell me if you don't want to be and I can always take it off. Here we are, follow this link and um, Yes, there you go. <laughs> Follow the link. I'm already a subscriber. <laughs> oh, what was I doing? Oh, yes, the corner tuck pocket. 
And we made this from a square of paper, didn't we? Did we have another one as well? Oh yes, it's literally, it wasn't rocket science, it was just a little square of paper. Well done, thank you, Beth. You've chatted with some of the ladies. Oh, that's fantastic. So I feel right at home. Oh, brilliant. Oh, do you know, I feel so at home in, in the chats and I love it. I find it all very inspiring and good company too. So let's make a little mini. Let's find some paper. <laughs> a little mini pocket for our for our mini journal here. This is what my desk is normally like. Actually, Ben came in yesterday before I tidied it up and he was, oh my goodness. I mean, it's usually piled high because I just go from one project to the next. So I'm folding it over to make a square. Obviously not a new idea, but sometimes it just thinks, oh, I haven't done that for a while, or I haven't done that before. So it's just another idea. Thank you, Beth, for reminding us. And fold it over like that. And like that. See, very easy. <laughs> and then you just make the little Shall I draw it? Oh, yes, maybe I should. <laughs> Make this little bit. I'm glad you feel at home. <laughs> it does feel like people are here with me at home crafting along. I love that. Or resting. Sending love to Caroline. listening along. Lovely to have you here. And cut that out. Sorry, just remind me if I'm not in frame. Thank you. Dropping Sana's link in. Thank you. Thank you. Gosh, you're all thinking ahead. Well done. Why didn't I say that? Sorry. I apologise. Very remiss of me. There we are. It's very simple. And then I'll just get some reach over. Get some tape. I know, Malaya, thank you. Too kind. <laughs> Pop that in there. And that, ooh, hold on, that's there. That just lines the inside of the pocket. Otherwise, it's just paper. Share with subscribe. Here we are. It's quiet without you here today, Melanie. Melanie's in the background, working away. Not craft work, work work. <laughs> it's fiddly diddly. There you go, pop that there. Loving that. And we've done that. Lovely. I've been edging everything in gold today, haven't I? I think I might just use the pen for this one, actually, so it dries. I don't know where my gold pen is. Somewhere. Let me look through my pencil case. It might be in here. Oh, it is here. 
if that's the other thing we were talking how relaxing hearing people go through um a button till is hearing people here she is are you calling me <laughs> am i calling you nosy no no not at all um melon is working hard that's what we're saying <laughs> it's relaxing here with people the pencil case that reminds you of getting a new pencil case before you went back to school this is a lovely excuse having this as a hobby isn't it just to collect pens and things again fiddly diddly it's made up word kathy do you know ben will tell you right Probably, I'm a little bit, I don't know, quirky. Do any other English people say fiddly diddly? I don't think so, do they, Melanie? <laughs> fiddly diddly. That's just me, I think. Ah, oh, dear. <laughs> so I, I love the gold one. I'm, I'm like Mary. I love the gold. I'll just open that out again. And I'll just go around the edges with gold. Make a corner pocket for it. Loving that. Melanie, I found that clay. See, I'm not like Beth. I can't put my hands on things straight away, but things turn up. I was looking for something else, and um, I found the clay. Melanie's got some... some you say fiddly-diddly, do you? Oh. But I never thought it was just me who said silly things like that. I don't know. Yay. <laughs> yes, I found the clay. So Melanie's got some things to demonstrate. Another time, maybe next week, no pressure. If she can make it, if she doesn't have to work. Oh, dear. Sometimes you just have to. You call it fussy cutting. Yes. And some fussy cutting is fiddly diddly, isn't it? <laughs> mm. Right. There you go. Just makes it nice and shiny. Just finishes it off. Do you, when people go through a phase or in a phase of using the ink and inking everything, I'm in a phase of putting gold paint or gold around everything. I'm into the gold at the moment. So, do you know, we could have made it even smaller, couldn't we? I'm loving that, but I do like a challenge. Hold on, I need to find a blank page. Right, hold on. Yes, that's quite cute, but it's, Actually, that is quite quite a good size. I was going to say I might be able to make it smaller. Malay is going to stop saying fiddly diddly. <laughs> it's very fiddly diddly. <laughs> oh, dear. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> oh, maybe, maybe more people do say it than I think, Melanie. Squeeze this out here. Thanks. Thank you. A very simple idea. Nothing that hasn't been done before, is it, Sherry? It's a case of... But now, I think we're just playing, really. Right. And let's pop that. I'm getting gluey. <laughs> I must be having a nice time beginning to make a mess. There we are. Pop that in like that. Pretty. Sure we all say it in, in my family. Oh, really? I never. <laughs> and there we are. It's sort of like you've got a little tuck in there. A little tuck in there. And then one in there, one in there. Well done, Cheryl. Getting me back to a small book. I love having. I always have a big one on the go. I always like having a little, because it just helps you use up all the little bits and pieces, doesn't it? 
so we don't have to throw anything away. Although Teresa said we can if we need to. <laughs> so our word of the day is diddly diddly. And I put a little, just sewed, sewed, tied a little piece of elastic there like that. This is my closure, so many ways. Joe is calling your corner pockets. Is what we he used to make and play table football and flick the bits back and forth. No way. How would you do that? Okay, hold on. Let's get another corner tuck. <laughs> table football. It's sort of like made up, not sabutio, made up. Oh, that's too funny. Like, like made up when you haven't, you're just making things out of paper and games. Like, yeah, brilliant. Hold on. That was ready for a, so it was like, how did you do it, Joan? How did you, were these the football players that you lined up? That's brilliant. And then you, back in his school days. Wasn't that long ago, Joe? Table football. <laughs> Brilliant. They used to stand like that, did they, Joe? You, I tell you what, you were going to have to demonstrate on um, Tuesday's live, aren't you? Look, I'm just making this happy mail up, Melanie. Sorry, Melanie, you're working, but I'm putting some of your lovely spray dots in there. Show us, oh, Tuesday is tomorrow, you're right. Show us tomorrow, Cheryl. We'll do, instead of journaling, we'll play table football. Hmm. Oh, some people with children and grandchildren might appreciate that idea. Put that on the happy now pile. <laughs> oh, well then. Lovely. Oh, I was going to show you. Hold on. I was going to show you um, this journal. So we got this one. Now this is taking it even smaller. Take the corner you made and flick it. <laughs> Take the corner you made and flick it. Did you used to play this, Cheryl? That's crazy good. You do this and then you flick it. We didn't used to do that, did we, Ben? It's absolutely brilliant. I love that. Hmm. Surprised we didn't. Yeah, Joe, you show us. And do you have a ball as well? Yeah, show us, Joe. Show us, show us, show us. Not shouting out because I know some people are sleeping. My niece might be fast asleep by now in the replay. Joe can demo. Thank you, Joe. Oh, now what's I showing you? I'm not quite sure of the dimensions of a micro journal. Maybe even this one's a micro journal. Was it three by three inches? I'm sorry, Melanie. I know you're meant to be working, darling. Um, but I've got this little one here, and I haven't put things in this one yet. I've got a little cover and a matching tag. This was made out of um, a greetings card. But how did I make this? Look. Now, I found this the other day in the bookshelf when I was looking through my mini books. Didn't Lizzie Brewer do something where she folded the pages like this? She probably did a bigger one and I do like to do mini things. So I thought while I've got little bits and pieces here that I might start to um, just, while I'm here, use this one. I thought that would be nice. As you say, ta-da, tiny, tiny. Kind of like, oh, was it a zine? Was it a, it is kind of like, it's not a storm book because we made a storm book. Oh, it'd be nice to ask Lizzie. I'm sure it was Lizzie. Um, Cheryl, bye. Oh, it's lunchtime. Yeah. 
can see the way it's folded there, can't you? Says, says me pulling it apart. Yeah. Um, Cheryl, it's lunchtime. Yes, you have to go at this sort of time. And, and Sana needs to go. So is this a good time to say we need to move on? Yes. I need to say goodbye. Once, I, once I'm here, I find it very hard to say goodbye because I'm just having such fun. <laughs> well, I had started. It's nice. You can just use wipe-offs. Fill it up. Thank you, Cheryl. Thank you. Thank you, Sana, for all your input. It's been fun. I have had such a fun time. Haven't we had a lovely time? And the drawing as we had the little pull out of a hat thing as well, didn't we? And you'll see Freddie and I are going to be, um, to show you my cake before you go. <laughs> oh, I made a muffin. It's an American muffin. I made it with um, butternut squash. And we dried the apples in the oven. You had to dry them in, you probably do that a lot in the States, maybe. I don't know. Um, and it was so funny. They all got stuck to the tray. And um, Sam, in the end, I, got, I, I was getting the scraper off. We, should, we didn't put grease proof down. And they would completely dry. And we were scraping away. And then he had to get a chisel. And he, I said, I said, oh, pity I'm not vlogging this. He said, yes, you could call it fail kitchen. <laughs> oh, dear. So it's probably time for you American girls to nip off and um, get lunch. And I'll sit and have afternoon tea. I've had such fun. Thank you so much. Making... Uh, what have been doing? Uh, making, putting things, sticking things in our girls just want to have fun journal. And in our, in our book, shall I just see if Freddie will come and say goodbye? Freddie! Freddie! Got a little treat here. Oh, Ben saying bye. Freddy. Freddy. He's not coming. I gave him such a small piece. Parchment paper. Yes, I should have put parchment paper down. It's so funny. Freddy, darling. The girls just want to say goodbye to you. Ben saying goodbye. Freddy. Where are you, darling? Come down. The girls want to say goodbye to you. Come on, Come on. 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 And I'll get you a nice treat. So let's slip over to Freddy Cam. Here he is. Let's see if we can get it up a little bit more. With our... There. There's lovely Freddy. There we are. Oh, yawning. He's been asleep on my bed. Haven't you? There you go. A little treat from the girls. Do you want to show the girls how you do a pull? There you go. Lovely. Well done, Freddy. Have another little treat. Oh, I made him in shadow then, didn't I? Here you go. Ooh, lovely. He's having little fish. He's having little sprats. Are they nice? Ooh, lovely. <laughs> oh, look, the girls are saying goodbye. Never a dull moment here. Oh, look at that. Here you go, Freddy. That's the last one. 
Oh, and this can be your little box that you have when we stream. So, gosh, let me just count. Everybody's saying goodbye and hugs and thank yous. Oh, bye-bye, Sherry. Bye-bye, Janice. Oh, Cheryl's gone. Bye-bye, dear Beth. Oh, that's lovely. Bye-bye, Melanie. You, I hope you can get a little bit more work done now we're not pestering you <laughs> and distracting you more like i'll bring it back he's gone he's gone out into the garden i'll bring it back around the camera so i can wave goodbye and i didn't even drop the camera today what a professional setup we've got now <laughs> goodbye everybody thank you so much for joining me thank you bye bye all <laughs>